Good morning, Denny. It is Wednesday, April 27th, and I am in my basement surrounded by lovely, inspiring designs because I am going to make you a canvas today and I'm going to mail it to you in the near future. And I really hope to see you do a canvas on, you know, what's it called? Friday. Friday. It's called Friday. Yeah, I thought the Bohemian Rhapsody with Helium was a little too impractical, mainly because the song is longer than five minutes, and therefore, if we both did it, we'd both break a rule again. <sighs> kind of seems silly, doesn't it? Boy, yeah. yeah. So, what am I making, Denny? That is for me to know and you to maybe find out at the end of this video. I might just send it to you and just surprise you. I don't know. I haven't planned this out yet. I'm just flying by the seat of my pants. Yo, yo, yo! That was weird and I apologize. So, recent things that have happened in my life. Um, my sister got engaged the other day, um, so that's pretty exciting. Um, life is pretty weird, um, but it also kind of highlights again, the fact that I am the only one of my family uh, that's over the age of 18 and single. Um, I know that probably doesn't say much to you, but in the Midwest, it's kind of weird. So along with that going on in my life, um, my ex-boyfriend kind of re-entered my life um, when circumstances beyond my control, when one of my good friends met him at the Divergent movie, and um, they are striking up a friendship that I am not super duper approval of. But what can you do about that? Um, you can't just tell a friend that you should stop seeing someone. Um, so I'm kind of struggling with that because um, I don't know. I just wanted to tell you this because you're my one of my best friends, and I feel like you deserve to know what's going on in my life. Um, so I'm internally struggling on whether I want to be unrealistic and childlike and demand they stop being friends with this person that they enjoy spending time with, or whether I want to be adult and bottle up all my feelings and emotions, like I usually do. So I've been listening to the song Closing Time a lot recently. Um, it's actually appearing in a video, I think, next Friday because I have lots of things planned out. Um, I've actually finished my entire video set for next week, um, but... It just kind of reminds me that I am at a junction where people are leaving me. Um, like the other day I had the last meeting with my boss that I will ever have, um, and he's going to be moving to Wisconsin. My other boss is moving across campus, but sometimes you have less excuses for those kind of people, but you still do not see them as often as you'd like. So that's kind of been running through my head, like this is a lot of time for endings, especially when it comes to college students. I also have lots of friends who are graduating, so that's kind of a weird feeling. I'm going to three graduation parties in one day. My peer mentors are graduating college, and it just baffles my mind. Um, other things that are going on in my life, um, I am actually conducting a psychological study. I am doing data entry and stuff about how people perceive transgender individuals and to see if they are the same as um, LGB individuals. Because it seems like the T is just often lumped into the acronym. This exercise is kind of teaching me that it's not just colors that people paint with, but it's also the brush. And I feel like there's a metaphor in tools shaping outcomes. I'm not sure what the metaphor is, but there's definitely one there. I've also kind of been looking at graduate schools. I, I know I'm only a sophomore, but um, I think there's really a large potential in looking early. Um, right now I'm doing dreaming schools. Um, I even kind of looked at Harvard. Um, I say that like I had any chance of getting in, but at this point I'm in the dreaming stage. So I thought, hey, why not? Time to remove the tape. You are going to be proud of me though because I am setting up a program for tomorrow where I'm registering my students to vote. Um, being a good and nice responsible RA. I decided I am going to show you, um, part of the way done because this is only partially done. So there are two canvases, one for me and one for you, both done in the Pollock style. Um, there they are, maybe better focus, but I will be writing some words on these and I will be sending one to you and I will be keeping one for myself. So look forward to this in the mail and also look forward to the words that come up. So I will see you on Friday, DFTBA, and stay super. Bye.